Many nations and humanitarian organizations have hurried to send manpower, resources, and supplies to aid with the rescue operations in Turkey and Syria's earthquake-stricken regions. Here is a quick look at what has been offered thus far. The European Union has dispatched search and rescue personnel to assist Turkey. In addition, the 27-nation bloc's Copernicus satellite system has been activated to provide emergency mapping services. At least 13 of the member nations have contributed. The EU declared that it is prepared to support Syria through its humanitarian aid initiatives. The US is organizing emergency aid for NATO member Turkey, including personnel to help with search and rescue operations. Humanitarian organizations backed by the United States are also reacting to the carnage in Syria. Nearly 100 firefighters, structural engineers, and six specially trained canines were being dispatched from California to assist in the rescue operations in Turkey. Russian rescue teams from the emergencies ministry are getting ready to travel to Syria, where Russian forces already present there have sent 10 units totaling 300 personnel to assist in clearing rubble and searching for survivors. The Russian military has established distribution hubs for aid. Additionally, Russia extended a helping hand to Turkey, which was welcomed.